The owner of Allure Salon and Spa says she tried doing hair outside. It is absolutely unbearable to be outside. It's not healthy to be outside. Last weekend was her first and last attempt, largely because of the heat. I don't want to have a heat stroke sitting outside here in this heat, waiting for my next client to show up. Amid this week's heat wave, that's the dilemma salons now face. Operate outdoors in triple digit heat. Fresh new masks for each one of our clients or close. My business is in jeopardy and same with every salon in California. Meanwhile, the city of Sacramento offering indoor respite today. We are going to open cooling centers throughout the city of Sacramento because it's the right thing to do. Along with handing out water bottles, there will be hand sanitizer, masks and temperature checks. As you can see the way this is laid out, um, we're going to maintain appropriate physical distancing. Because of COVID precautions, the maximum number of people allowed inside this cooling center, 35 people. We will make it work and, uh, and we are prepared to open up additional facilities if needed and if these uh, current operated ones start to reach capacity. So the obligation is to both bring people inside and at the same time, keep them safe. And that's exactly uh, what, we'll, what we will do, as you can see the way this is laid out here. As the city opens up the indoors today, businesses hoping government officials give them the same consideration. It is safer inside. It is not safe outside. Missy O'Daniel's salon is right across the street from the governor's mansion. On this very, very busy, busy, busy street. After investing $10,000 to make the inside of her salon safe, you have social distancing panels. Oh, Daniel is asking Governor Gavin Newsom to get her business off the street. And it's heartbreaking that we feel neglected. We feel like we are a forgotten industry.